In the heart of the quaint, shadowy town of Ravenwood, midnight strikes on Halloween night. The air, thick and heavy with the promise of the unknown, is pierced only by the eerie hoot of a distant owl and the rhythmic patter of raindrops on cobblestone streets. A chilling wind weaves its way through the narrow alleyways, delivering a tangible sense of foreboding to all who dare to listen. Enter Sarah, a woman with a penchant for the peculiar. On this night you would find her cloaked in darkness, her attire a reflection of the macabre, a tattered black cloak, a pointed hat, and in her hand a lantern. Its flickering light dances across her path, casting ominous shadows that seem to come alive in the midnight hour. Sarah is not your ordinary Halloween enthusiast. She revels in the supernatural, the inexplicable, the uncharted. And on this night, she carries out a tradition that would make the bravest of souls shudder. A tradition steeped in mystery and whispered about in hushed, fearful tones. A solitary walk in the rain, a journey into the heart of the unknown, a quest for the ghostly whispers rumored to roam the town. As she ventures deeper into the darkness, the wind carries the faintest hint of spectral murmurs. The whispers grow louder, weaving a chilling tale of times long past. Sarah listens, her heart beating in sync with the rhythmic patter of the rain, her soul alight with the thrill of the unknown. But then, something changes. The whispers grow silent. The wind ceases its wild dance. Even the rain seems to hold its breath. Sarah stops, her lantern casting a feeble glow around her. She is alone, yet not alone. A presence looms, a shadow in the darkness. And then, well, my dear listener, some stories are better left unfinished, for now at least. After all, every tale has its time and every whisper, its wind. And who knows what the next Halloween night in Ravenwood might bring?